Attorney General Jeff Sessions in the hot seat grilled over what he knew about the Trump campaign's Russia contacts and whether he told the truth in previous testimony. Our senior justice correspondent Pierre Thomas has more. He's there in Washington. Good morning, Pierre. Robin, good morning. It was a contentious hearing with Democrats on the attack and Sessions pushing back hard. I had a meeting with the Russian ambassador, yes. That's exactly the opposite answer you gave under oath to U.S. Senate. So again, either you're lying to U.S. Senate or you're lying to U.S. House of Representatives. Well, Attorney General Jeff Sessions defiant, at times indignant, at the suggestion that he lied to Congress. I will not accept and reject accusations that I have ever lied. That is a lie. Just last month, Sessions testified that he never knew of any communications between Russian operatives and the Trump campaign. I'm not aware of those activities. And I wasn't and am not. I don't believe they occurred. But those activities discussed in that March 2016 meeting with Sessions, then candidate Donald Trump and former Trump foreign policy advisor George Papadopoulos, who said he had connections who could arrange talks between Trump and Vladimir Putin. Papadopoulos has since pled guilty to lying to the FBI. Sessions said he had forgotten about that meeting, only recalling it amid press reports. There are reports that you shut George down, in, unquote, when he proposed that meeting with Putin. Is this correct, yes or no? Yes, I pushed back. And his answer to how he could forget a meeting like that. It was a brilliant campaign, I think, in many ways, but it was a form of chaos every day from day one. Sessions said, although his answers have changed, one fact remains true. He was only trying to convey he was never part of and never knew of any attempts by the Trump campaign to collude with the Russians to impact the election. Guys? Okay, but many others will be weighing in with Robert Mueller and what they said mm -hmm, they to will. the Attorney General as well.